Mkwicho. Le President. The President. Please be seated. The court is now in session. As scheduled, today the chamber is hearing the testimony of TCW 801. Mr. Sarkovote is now directed to report to the chamber the current status of the parties to the proceedings today. Good morning, Mr. President and Bonjour, Your Honours. All the parties to the proceedings are present. Mr. Nunjie is present in Monsieur his holding cell based de on the de decision made by the trial chamber de and de it is chambre. because due to his health. Today, the chamber is hearing TCW 800 and one and according to the best knowledge of the witness, the witness says uh, the witness is not in a relationship with an accused or a civil party as provided in some rule two of rule 24 and the witness already took the oath. The witness will be assisted uh, by the jury counsel, Mr. Mom Rutier, and the witness has no. Uh, today there is no reserve witness. The president, uh, thank you. Court officer is now directed to bring in the witness for today, please. The President. Good morning, Mr. Witness. What's your name? The President, uh, Mr. Witness, could you please hold on a little bit? Wait until you see the red light activated on that console before you proceed to respond. Otherwise, your message would not be Sinon, properly conveyed. Please be reminded that uh, your message will be pas. interpreted into tout, two other working languages, including French travail, and English. You may now proceed. Response. I am Nu Mao, Nou alias Mok. Good morning, Mok. Mr. President and Your Honours. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président. The President. Oui, Monsieur le Juge. Thank you, Mr. Mao. How old are Monsieur you? Le Président. Merci, Monsieur Mao. Quel âge avez-vous? Response. Réponse. I am 78 years old. 78. The President. Thank you. Where were you Question. born, Mr. Mao? Où êtes-vous né, Monsieur Mao?
response. I was born Réponse. in Samaki village. Je suis né au village de Samaki. Question. In which district and province, please? Le président. Et dans quelle province, quel district? The president, uh, Mr. Mao, please um, Monsieur Mao, tell the chamber your birthplace again. Vous répéter où vous êtes? The President, uh, Mr. Witness, uh, please answer again regarding the place of your birth. Tell the chamber which district, which province you were born in. Response. I was born in Udong district of Kampung Spu, and the village name is uh, Yut. Sam Maki. Dans le village de Samaki. Question: Where do you live? Question. Response: Où habites-vous? I live in Udong district dans of district Kampung Spu, the same Udong, province de uh, commune, but uh, this time Trapeang Thom village. village Trapeang Thom. Question: What do you do Question. for a living? Quelle est votre profession? Response. I am Réponse. a peasant. Je suis In the past, paysan. I used to climb sugar palm trees to collect uh, sugar dans palm for passé, making sugar. Grimpé dans des palmiers pour récupérer euh, le, la sève pour Question. What's your father's name? Question. Comment s'appelle votre père? Response. Réponse. He is Nu, and I am Nu, nu Mao. Et moi, je suis Nu Mao. However, this is the way they know us in our Trapeang Thom village. Dans le village de Trapeang Question, Trapeang what's Trapeang. your mother's name? Question, comment s'appelle votre mère? Response, Réponse. she is Kun Wood. Elle s'appelle Kun Wood. Question, what's your wife's name Question. and how many children do you have? Et combien d'enfants avez-vous? Response, she is large non and we have seven non. children. The president, thank you Mr. Numao. According to the report by the greffier of the trial the chamber Merci, and to the Nou best Mao. of your knowledge, you are not in a relationship with the accused or civil party in this case. In other words, you are not uh, in the relationship with the two accused, Mr. Kiusampan and Nunji and that you already took uh, the oath on the 12th of June 2013. Is that correct? Yes, exact. Response. Réponse. Yes, it is. En effet. I already took the oath here. J'ai déjà prêté ça. The President. Thank you, Mr. Nu Mao. Le Président. 
Merci, Monsieur Now the Ndou. chamber would like uh, to notify you of your rights. Chambre souhaite à présent vous informer de vos droits. And the uh, Rule 28 uh, right against self-incrimination of witnesses. Qui vous As a witness, you may object effet, to making any statement that might tend to incriminate you. In other words, you have the right not to incriminate yourself. Vous pouvez donc refuser And de vous incriminer. As the witness, Mr. Numao, you shall vous respond to all the questions put by the judges of the bench and the parties to the proceedings. And you shall speak the truth, dire the whole la vérité, truth, la nothing la but the truth. Et rien que la and you shall respond to all the questions based on your et experiences and the events you have come across. Vous and please be straight to the questions témoin. put to you in your response. Mr. Nu Muk, rather Mr. Nu Mao, Monsieur have you Nou ever Mao. Provided any interview to any of the co-investigators of the OCIJ office. Par les enquêteurs du bureau des co-juges d'instruction. Response. I gave interview Réponse. to the international newspaper. Donné une interview à un Question. Do you still recall enfin pour un journal étranger, where you provided question. such interview and in which vous year, please? Souvenez-vous de l'endroit et de la date de cet entretien. Response. It was a long time ago, and the events that happened over 30 years already um, could not make me remember everything, because now I am old and my memory is no longer good. And with that, I sincerely apologize if I cannot recollect the, the detailed information de me souvenir des of. détails que l'on s'attend à ce que je donne. The President, thank you, Mr. Mao. Merci, Monsieur Mao. You just stated that currently you are Nu Mao, vous venez de alias dire que vous Mo. Vous Nu Mao, alias Mo. I have a question to you. J'aimerais savoir. When did you begin using? Mao as your name, quand and when exactly did you start using Moke et quand as your name also? Moke. Response. Réponse. At the beginning, I was Nu Mao. Au début, j'ai appelé Nu Mao. In my commune unit, there were two commune, persons having the same name. Le même nom. I mean, two persons bearing Mao as their names. Mao. And since I was used by the commune, uh, the name uh, had to be changed. Donc on a changé le nom. Mon nom. The President, uh, thank you. We would like uh, to hand Merci. over to the co-prosecutors to begin Je putting questions uh, to the witness uh, before other parties oh, to the proceedings. Legal lawyers for the civil parties will uh, follow uh, up uh, with Et some questions and both uh, counsels will have half day for that. Civils, dispose d'une demi-journée pour cet interrogatoire. Mr. President, Your Honours, uh, good morning, may it please you. Good morning to my fellow counsel. And in particular, good morning to you, Nu Mao. My name is Keith Rayner. 
and I am one of the prosecutors in this case. Je suis un des procureurs de ce procès. You have already told the court that you remember giving vous avez dit à la, à la an interview to an international un, newspaper un a long time ago. We have on our court file document Nous number D313 slash 1.2.2. That document contains nine pages of handwritten notes by an international man called Ben Kiernan. The document has your name in the form Nu Mook. Et sur le document, on retrouve votre nom, Nu Mook. The words Udong, 26 August 1981, appear. Does that refresh your memory about the interview Cela vous with the international la newspaper? À propos de cette interview avec le journal étranger. Response. Réponse. I did give interview to the newspaper at uh, Odong district, district office de, on one occasion. De Udong, and it was on another occasion when during the war y avait aussi I une was autre, interviewed une autre fois pendant la guerre. also it was uh, in the battlefield sur le when the interview bataille. was uh, taken and the commune committee allowed comité me de to lead the people in to bring people to the battle to the battlefield to bring food uh, to the soldiers and also to fetch uh, or carry the wounded the wounded uh, combatants and I was afraid. I was afraid because the Khmer Rouge did not spare any person, in, uh, for example, uh, a reporter who met uh, them. They were lucky to meet me. Because on one occasion, as I remember, Odong was attacked and soldiers, prisoners of war, were evacuated to the west uh, direction, all the way to the Tpong area, Tpong. and a lot of people had uh, been evacuated to that place. De gens été I don't know what happened to them. Je ne sais pas ce qui leur est arrivé. And in the battlefield, I may have to go back a little bit. Peut-être que je, je dois remonter un peu en arrière. I asked people to escape because at that time aerial bombardments were heavy. Il y avait beaucoup de bombardements aériens. Some wounded people had to be brought to the rear, and that 
are the people, including women, women combatants, had to move into the battlefield to bring food to the soldiers. And then at that time, I was approached by the reporter, and that. Um, I told them that uh, they were lucky to see me, and I also advised uh, that they, they had to make uh, their way to the uh, territory controlled by the Lonol. And at that time, that area was uh, controlled by Chan Reang Sei. Later on, surveillance uh, was uh, carried out against me and I was accused of uh, trying to f arrange the escape for the American newspaper, a new news reporter. And I told them that uh, I did not engage in uh, arranging the escape of these uh, reporters because uh, that happened during the war and it was chaotic and that people had uh, disappeared uh, on their own volition. And, uh, and uh, later on, things didn't stop there because uh, they tried to find out more about what I had done to the reporters. Avec ces journalistes. Thank you, Mr. Numo. I want to concentrate not on the interview, oh, sorry. No. Uh, Mr. President, the witness is holding up a photograph which I believe may Monsieur be relevant. Président, Can I ask a question based on this document? Uh, photo qui, je crois, être pertinente. Puis je pose une question à propos de la photo. The President, you may proceed. Le président, Mr. Numo, I've just Monsieur seen Numo, you hold up in the courtroom a one-page photograph in black and white. Can I ask you, why did you bring that photograph to court, and who is the person shown on the photograph? Response. The person in the photo is Ben Kiernan. Ben Kiernan was the ben uh, journalist uh, who interviewed me. Qui I would like to read his name again. He is uh, ben, Kiernan. ben Kiernan. And I still recognize him. And indeed, uh, I am reading out his name Je so that uh, the message is clear that this is the person we are referring to. And uh, please uh, forgive me if I do not uh, remember every detail of uh, this account. Uh, and the I, I, I am an ordinary person who uh, was uh, meant to be used uh, by other people in the regime, and I ha am never engaged uh, in all of this, in particular in the Khmer Rouge. And when it comes to Khmer Rouge, the term in Khmer, Red Khmer, it means uh, the people who were stained with red blood uh, on their hands, Khmer Rouge and que ces people gens were du colored, labeled, executed discriminatingly. So again, the Khmer Rouge here referring, uh, is, uh, referring Khmer Rouge to uh, those uh, who had uh, blood on their hands. Qui ont les mains tachées de sang. Thank you. Mr. President, given that the witness, Mr. Nu Mao, has now confirmed that he gave the interview with Ben Kiernan, has referred to a photograph of Ben Kiernan, and made it clear that he wants that name to be recorded, 
qu'il souhaitait que le nom soit and given that this interview took place 31 inscrit, years ago et que l'événement remonte à il y a 31 ans it is my respectful application that this witness like other witnesses should be provided now with a copy of this relevant document témoins, so that the témoins, question and answers make sense to him. Can I please proceed in that fashion? The President of Council for Mr. Kyusampan. Thank you, Mr. President. Ah, bonjour d'abord et bonjour à all, mesdames et messieurs de la Chambre et à l'ensemble des partis. Je pense que là, il y a un petit raccourci uh, qui est un peu rapide à mon sens avant de uh, montrer les notes uh, de cet entretien à monsieur le témoin. Je pense qu'il y a des questions préalables qui doivent être posées, à savoir uh, dans quelles conditions le témoin se souvient que des notes ont été prises s'il a Under eu la possibilité de les revoir, uh, je pense qu'il y a un certain nombre de questions préalables uh, à poser. Et il me semble que uh, la uh, pratique de la Chambre a toujours été celle-ci, à savoir avant de montrer un document, uh, de savoir si uh, le témoin connaissait auparavant la teneur et s'il avait la possibilité, il avait eu la possibilité de uh, les revoir. Donc, uh, J'objecte à ce qu'on présente le document en l'état avant que ces questions préalables aient été précisées. The, hap the events happened a long time ago, over 30 years, and it could not make me remember everything. I am old, and my memory is no longer good, and that was followed by an apology. So I'm going to ask some questions, but then I'm going to repeat my application. Mr. Numao, when Ben Kiernan came to interview you. Combien Kernan est venu vous interviewer? Do you remember if he came on his own or with vous si another international man? Ou s'il était accompagné d'un autre étranger? Response. Réponse. Later on, they came to conduct research Plus tard, ils sont venus at effectuer Udong des recherches district. dans le district And I also was accused. Et on m'a accusé. They didn't arrest or detain Et me. Ils ne m'ont pas arrêté. I was allowed to raise a domestic animals on permis in Udong des animaux domestiques. district. Please forgive me. I'm, I'm just trying to concentrate on this interview with Ben Kiernan. Now, his documents suggest that that interview happened after the Vietnamese had invaded. Two years afterwards, in 1981, on the 26th of August, 1981. Now, does that date of 1981 sound about right to you for the date when you gave the interview to Ben Kiernan? Yes, that is correct. C'est exact. He went uh, to see me with uh, two cars at that time. Uh, he was looking for me. Il est me. venu me Il y avait he, uh, deux voitures. Asked uh, me as to how far was it from Dong to Phnom Chom Rok. Il m'a demandé quelle distance il y avait entre And I told him that I did not know uh, it either. Question. 
When Ben Kiernan came Début to see you in two cars, ben Kiernan est venu vous voir was avec there another person with him? Y avait-il avec lui une autre personne? Or was he on his own? To your recollection. Où était-il seul? D'après vos souvenirs. He went along uh, in two cars, and there were uh, several people, male and female, but uh, prior to a conducting interview with me, he offered me a cigarette, and I did uh, smoke that cigarette. When I finished uh, the cigarette for about one or two minutes, then he started uh, asking me, uh, at the uh, place, uh, there were two beds uh, where we uh, sat on, uh, and we um, started the interview. So it is correct uh, as reported in this uh, document. Ce I did uh, provide an interview with him. Uh, however, I wish to note that I have uh, forgotten uh, much of its detail. Which village did this interview take place in? Dans quel village est-ce que cet entretien a eu lieu? It was at the uh, district hall. Did Mr. Kiernan ask you questions in Khmer du district. or another language which was translated? Question. Est-ce que Ben Kiernan vous a interrogé en Khmer ou en une autre langue auquel cas ces questions auraient été traduites en Khmer pour vous? No, he did not speak Khmer, Réponse. but it was translated into Khmer. 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 Ces questions ont été traduites en Khmer. When he asks, asked you questions, do you remember if he question. had a, some paper vous -vous and a pen and wrote down your answers? Du papier et un stylo, et s'il a consigné vos réponses? No, I did not take any notes. He could have Je pas taken de notes. some notes Lui a because pris he notes. wanted information from me. Car il voulait obtenir de ma part des Do you remember if any Question. of the people in the room were using a Parmi tape gens recorder dans la salle, of some que kind? Utilisaient un appareil enregistreur? Me and me. Yes, réponse. yes, there was. There was someone oui. recording the interview using audio equipment. Avec du matériel Does the name audio. Michael Vickery Question. ring any bells? Est-ce que le nom de Michael Vickery vous dit quelque chose? Um. I only Réponse. recall uh, that uh, I had met uh, this person Je me uh, during the uh, uh, war uh, time uh, in the Pendant battle. I guerre. once met him, and then he Pendant again combats, uh, tried to look for me, and he came all the way to meet me for ensuite, that interview again. Mr. President, in my respectful submission, the evidential interview. foundation has Question. now been laid. Can Début I please, with your permission, and a copy of this interview to Mumao in Khmer. I ask the authorization to remove an exemplar of this document to Mr. Mumao in Khmer. The President. The President. International Council, Mr. Victor Coppe, you may proceed. Mr. Coppe. Thank you, Mr. President. Bonjour. We also form an objection. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Um, good morning, Mr. President. Um, Your Honours, as I said, we also object to this Comme je le disais, procedure. Nous aussi, no basis nous whatsoever has cette been uh, laid. Aucun été um, posé. It's obvious that 
this witness de toute évidence, doesn't speak English. le présentez-moi um, ne parle so pas l'anglais. Le document que nous avons uh, sous les yeux est un document écrit par Mr. Lee. Uh, Mr. Lee is speaking qui expose um, le contenu de l'interview. This witness only speaks Khmer, so Ce there's really no relevance Khmer, um, uh, for this document to be donc, presented to uh, the il witness. Il n'y a aucune so raison de présenter ce document au témoin. C'est pourquoi nous formons une objection. Oui, Monsieur le Président, euh, juste pour compléter yes, euh, l'objection que j'ai faite tout à l'heure et qui n'a, à mon sens, pas encore trouvé de réponse, euh, la question, euh, j'ai bien compris que euh, Monsieur le coprocureur indique que euh, le témoin se souvient euh, avoir été euh, interviewé par Monsieur Ben Kirnan. La question a été posée euh, de euh, la traduction effectuée, mais euh, nous, nous ne savons pas par qui euh, l'interprétation a été effectuée ce jour-là. Je pense que c'est un élément qui est important. Euh, et par ailleurs, euh, la question euh, que je posais tout à l'heure et qui Moreover, doit, à mon sens, être posée au témoin avant euh, d'aller plus avant est de savoir s'il a pu euh, relire à un quelconque moment les notes ou si on lui a relu les notes qui ont été prises ce jour-là, euh, de façon à ce que l'on sache lorsque le document euh, lui sera représenté s'il a pu effectuer des corrections ou pas par so rapport à ce qui a été dit. Il paraît que je pars trop vite. Uh, je répète, uh, je pense que la question au préalable, avant de pouvoir montrer les quelques notes uh, prises ce jour-là en anglais par M. Ben Kiernan, est de savoir si le témoin a pu uh, relire ces notes, ou en tout cas si on lui a relu ces notes, et quelle est la personne um, qui uh, uh, s'est occupée de l'interprétation. Et uh, un point aussi, nous ne savons pas, et ça, ça n'apparaît pas euh, du document euh, dont il est question, si euh, ce And sont effectivement les notes euh, de M. Bert Kernan qui, qui ont été prises précisément ce jour-là, ou si ces notes sont le fruit d'un travail postérieur. Ça encore, nous n'avons pas la possibilité de le savoir, et je pense que les questions préalables aux témoins sont donc nécessaires avant que l'on puisse lui présenter un document dont nous ne savons pas dans quelles conditions il a été exactement rédigé puisque M. Ben Kiernan n'a pas souhaité se présenter devant cette chambre. toutes les parties ont pu le consulter. Ce document figure sur la liste déposée par la précession de l'application de la règle 80. Il figure dans l'annexe 12 tel que modifié. In my respectful submission, this witness should not be put at a disadvantage, il ne faut pas placer especially because ce témoin of the time lapse since the giving dans of une this position interview. défavorable compte tenu du temps qui s'est écoulé depuis l'interview. Comme on le sait, this court un nombre incalculable de témoins sont venus déposer et l'on a pu le rafraîchir la mémoire en leur présentant des documents ayant été établi aussi récemment qu'en 2009. Ici, nous avons un témoin âgé qui affirme ne pas se souvenir exactement de tous les événements. À mon avis, la justice et l'équité exigent que ce témoin ait le droit qu'on lui rafraîchisse Can la I mémoire, also add comme cela a été fait avec les autres témoins. En outre, the history of this case, as far as Ben Kiernan is concerned, to say that he refused to testify. Il est faux d'affirmer que Ben Kiernan a refusé de déposer. En fait, il a demandé à déposer par liaison vidéo. Monsieur le Président, cela fait une demi-heure que nous débattons de ce problème. 
Je maintiens ma I can see my friends on her feet. Pour pouvoir I ask you not to allow her to make further submissions and for this testimony à la to chambre de ne pas l'autoriser à faire d'autres observations. Je demande à la chambre à ce que la déposition du témoin puisse se poursuivre. The president, uh, that is correct. Uh, the council has not granted the floor uh, to reply to this issue. The President, I hand over the floor to Judge Sylvia Cartwright uh, to clarify on this issue to the parties concerning the document subject to examination now. Judge, you may proceed. Yes, thank you, President. Uh, first, a procedural matter uh, where, a, where an objection has been made and responded to. The Chamber will not normally allow a further uh, reply by um, the objectors. Uh, as to the objections themselves, the Chamber uh, accepts that uh, this document, La uh, that sufficient groundwork has been laid for this document uh, to document be the document subject of questioning of the witness. Uh, this will be, of course, uh, this uh, of course includes questioning by the defense uh, and uh, ultimately defense. the weight that will be placed on the document en fin de compte, uh, is for the chamber, la to, chamber to determine. La uh, so Robert the objections are not sustained. Les objections Thank you, President. Sont donc Merci, Monsieur le President. Mr. Newmore, can you tell us, please, Monsieur what Newmore, year it was when you joined the revolution? En quelle année vous êtes-vous rallié à la révolution? I have uh, forgotten the date because it has been a long time. I, I could uh, respond to you if I had a chance to look at the document and je I can refer uh, to si je my uh, earlier statement. I have forgotten, uh, I am uh, becoming more forgetful now. I cannot recall the uh, exact date when I joined the revolution. La date exacte à laquelle je me suis rallié à la révolution. Mr. President, with your leave, can I now please parle, supply a copy of the statement? J'aimerais apparemment remettre, à présent ce document au témoin dans, dans sa version Khmer. The President, Le président. you may proceed. Je Court officer, prie, please obtain a hard copy document from the prosecutor and hand it over to du the witness for his examination. Mr. President, I could see that Milena from Mr. Copy was on his feet. And I, I don't want to Maître Copé do this levé. without him being given the chance to object. Je ne veux pas continuer sans lui laisser l'occasion de soulever une objection. I don't understand, Mr. President, Maître that's why Copé. I object. Why Je ne comprends pas. Double objection. Khmer translation of the original Pourquoi document. Pourquoi est-ce qu'une uh, traduction Khmer du document original uh, devrait être remise au témoin? The original document is English, document original est en and uh, if he has anything intelligent to say about this document, he si should be confronted with the English original version, not with the Khmer translation. À dire sur ce document, il faudrait lui présenter la version That's originale anglaise Mr. et President. pas la Can I please proceed? L'accusation. Ceci est ridicule, Monsieur le Président. Puis-je continuer?
The President, Mr. Prosecutor, you may proceed. Je vous en prie. Mr. Numu, that document has large black numbers in the top left hand of each page. I know your duty council will assist. If you look at the Khmer page with this number, 009, 099, 0996, Si vous prenez la page 009, 09936, et en anglais, page, forgive me. Excusez-moi, en clair, 009, 009, 009, 939. Si vous dites que vous êtes allé à la Révolution en 1971, do those dates sound about right? Est-ce que ces dates vous semblent plus ou moins exactes Can I ask duty counsel to try and assist the witness to get to page number Khmer 009 099936 It's the first page. C'est la première page. And on that page, you state that you joined the revolution in 1971. To your recollection, was it 1971 when you joined the revolution? At the time, I was a member of the uh, Commune Party in Chiengras. I joined the revolution in 1971. And prior to 1971, uh, I, or pri rather prior to joining the revolution, I was a farmer in Compote province. Thank you, Mr. Numero. I want to ask you Question. about a meeting that you discussed in these notes. Une que it vous was a 1972 meeting une qui tenue en 1972. when Tamok met some monks. Au cours de and I Tamok quote from these notes. Des moines. Je vais citer. In 1972, at a meeting of over 3,000 monks in Kampong Chiang, Mok said, don't let the Viennese troops station in the watts or in villages. 
they can only buy food with permission written. Elles ne peuvent Close acheter quote. de la nourriture qu'au moyennant une permission écrite. Fin de citation. Did Mock explain why these instructions were to be implemented ces instructions devaient être involving the Vietnamese? En ce qui concernait les Vietnamiens. Tamok convened a general meeting. Tamok a convoqué une réunion générale. Somewhere I forget. À un endroit qui m'échappe. Uh, in the same notes, Question. Uh, it's English ERN 0041 Khmer 0090943, and French 00893550. You stated as follows about this meeting, and I quote. I was there, invited by two monks. There was then no patriotic monks association. The monks meeting was to get them to defrock, to join the army. End quote. My question is, Voici ma question. do you know if any monks joined si the army after this meeting? Après cette réunion? I have uh, forgotten. Réponse. J'ai oublié. I want to move on Question. to which positions were held by Tarmok and Chuchet in the southwest zone. Dans la zone du sud-ouest. What position did Chu Chet have? Quel était le poste occupé par Chu Chet? Chu Chet. Chu Chet was Réponse. in charge of political Chuchet affairs at that time. Des As for à l'époque. Tamok, uh, he was in charge Tamok, of military lui, affairs. Tamok était chargé des questions militaires. Both Chu Chet and Tamok at the Chuchet beginning. Chu Chet et Tamok. Uh, Chu Chet uh, was uh, more senior. Eh bien, Chu Chet était plus haut placé. So, Chu Chet was tasked uh, to discuss with monks. Était chargé de He discuter avec les monks. Monk. Uh, to join the army. Il a so at that time, les moines à intégrer l'armée. Correction interpreter, um, Tamok, not Chuchet. Tamok so Tamok 
convene a meeting of monks to lure them to the frock. pour les inciter à se défroquer. I do not recall the year when he convened uh, that meeting, but at that time all monks were defrocked and they were supposed to join the army. That is all what I knew at that time. You say in these notes that Chuches alias was C S Y. And you also say that he was in the Central Committee. Qu'il était membre du Comité Central. The President. Uh, witness, please hold on. Mr. Victor Cope, you may proceed. Yes, Mr. President, I do object against uh, uh, the way of questioning um, by, the, by the prosecutor. It's now being said that this witness uh, said in this uh, statement or that he stated, no, what we have in front of us is uh, an English version of the transcript. He might have said that, uh, we don't know. It's not an official statement uh, taken by uh, official investigators or by a judge. It's just a, a, a handwritten verbatim uh, report of what might have been uh, uh, said by this uh, witness during that interview. We should not pretend here today that this is an official uh, uh, witness statement. Uh, in conformity with all relevant procedures, it's just a, a piece of paper, uh, presumably writing down what this witness uh, has said to Keenan, nothing more. So I, I really object to the words you stated or you said. Alors on peut utiliser l'expression vous avez affirmé. Mr. President, again, submissions about weight, not admissibility. I will use different wording than you said. Il s'agit d'observations sur le poids et non sur la recevabilité. Et This je document records you telling Mr. Kean that C was in document, the Central vous avez dit Committee. À Kiernan que C siégeait au comité was central. Est-ce que C siégeait au comité central? And if so, how did you know this? Et si oui, comment le saviez-vous Le témoin, le président, sur le interprète. Monsieur le témoin, veuillez attendre, la parole est à la défense. La défense. Je maintiens mon objection. Uh, this is going, I find ridiculous. Je um, pense que la tournure pour l'interrogatoire de devient ridicule. Is recorded as having said that he is member of the Central Committee, and then asking the same question. That is, that is the, the very le definition of a leading le question. It shouldn't be done like that. Just ask open questions uh, as, as you, as you do in normal le court. On doit poser des questions Mr. Comme President, I think this is the fourth occasion upon which, when I've been asking Monsieur questions, Mr. Coppe has made this exact submission. I have counted it on four occasions. You have overruled him on four occasions. Do I have to repeat again that this practice has been well established before this tribunal? I know on occasions last year when Mr. Coppe was not here, but I am proceeding in accordance with your direction, Mr. President, repeated on at least four occasions. Can I proceed? Donner les instructions auxquelles je me conforme à plusieurs reprises, puis je procéder de la façon que j'ai choisi. Le président. I believe there are two issues here. First, il y a deux you already questions. promised to counsel uh, that you would like uh, to reframe your line of questioning. Que vous allez Nonetheless, uh, the line of questioning appears to be the same as the pourtant, previous questions uh, before questions the objection was made. Uh, we believe that uh, if uh, you honored uh, the promise, then the problems would not si arise. Vous aviez votre we did parole, not... Uh, le take action regarding the objection recently by Council Coppe because uh, we were expecting your 
refrain mean your way of questioning the witness with that uh, the chamber would like uh, you to take into account uh, uh, this and if you resort to going back to the same line of questioning, then you would risk uh, such objection. Si the objection sustained. Uh, so, uh, Mr. Objection, Co Prosecutor, you are now instructed uh, to report the question in different ways. Formule and that uh, the way the document is being treated before the chamber should uh, be not the way we treat the document as the statement before the co-investigators. Thank you, Mr. President. President. Mr. Numo, do you know if Chuchet held any positions beyond those in the southwest zone? Thank you, Mr. President. Response. Chuchet Elia C. Chuchet was in charge of C. politics. And he was very good at that. He was good at mobilizing people behind him. And Mok uh, was in charge of the military. Mok, lui, était responsable. However, Chu Chet uh, gained more popularity from the civilian than, uh, than um, Mok, because Mok uh, was uh, popular among the military. Did you ever receive any instructions, teaching, or study sessions where Chu Chet was the teacher? Vous vous jamais suivi des séances d'études où Chuchet était responsable de l'éducation. Response. Présidé par Chuchet. Réponse. Yes, uh, I was. Uh, oui. He taught me at uh, a pagoda in Tpong. Il m'a enseigné uh, area. dans une pagode près de Tpong. I forget the Tpong. name of that Donc, pagoda already, I believe. Oh. And uh, the study sessions uh, were conducted uh, to the Et north of Kai Tok Pagoda, and about 300 people attended the sessions. Although I stated, uh, although it stated in this uh, record that about 300 Même people si attended the sessions, but to me, I believe that there were about 200 people, and the session lasted uh, for about Et two months. Les, les a duré deux mois. And the attendees uh, were those potential les cadres uh, who would uh, be tasked uh, with mobilizing the people to join the cadre potentiel resistance qui movement uh, to liberate uh, the country. So I can pays. say now that there were Je about 200 participants uh, in that uh, section and uh, the interpreter corrects uh, the session lasts for Mais about one month or so. Corrige, now when Chu Chet was teaching, Question. did he Chu ever say anything about the Vietnamese and how you should treat the Vietnamese? S'il parlait de la façon dont il fallait traiter les Vietnamiens. Response. Réponse. He didn't mention about the Vietnamese. Il n'a pas parlé des Vietnamiens. Au Vietnam. Ou du Vietnam. I don't Vietnam. remember hearing him say it in that session. 
but uh, Vietnam or Vietnamese were regarded as the friends of Cambodia. Vietnamese helped Cambodia. That's what uh, they said about Vietnam. Now, can you re now remember where the study sessions took place? So no response. It were uh, they were conducted at Pong district, dans le district de Tong, to the north of Kai Tok Pagoda, Pagode which was Kai it was about Tok. two kilometers from that pagoda and the uh, place where we attended the sessions uh, was near the river bank and the session that was carried out for about one month or so and in the study sessions uh, Vietnamese were not regarded as the enemies and that what he taught us and the sessions uh, were for the cadres who attended and we were all instructed uh, not to treat the Vietnamese as uh, our enemies but uh, friends because they helped uh, Cambodia. Apart from being taught by Chu Chet, can you now remember the names of the other teachers? Response. I don't remember all the teachers. Je ne me I, afraid, pas de I'm afraid I don't recollect uh, those names. Je crains de pas me souvenir des noms. So, frankly, I do not wish to hide anything, je but my memory does not serve me well soit, to recollect the, the event. It was a long, long time ago. Can you now remember the exact year when you were being lectured by Chu Chet? Response. No, I don't remember the exact year. I don't. Mr. President, the witness has now said he does not remember the exact year and he does not remember the names of other teachers. This material is contained in the Ben Kiernan notes and I do apply, having asked open-ended questions, now to put the document to see if it refreshes the witness's memory. The President, you may Le proceed. Oui, allez you, the record states from this interview as follows. On dans Quote, les notes. Et je sais. At Cantut in 1973, there were 200, sometimes 150 people, cadres, studying. Qui étudient. Teachers were Les C. Mok C. Park, Park. Close quote. That is on English page 00419458. Khmer 00909936. And French 00893546. Mr. Numu, has that refreshed your memory that it was in 1973 and the other teachers were mock and pal? Response. Yes, uh, I uh, now remember mock. 
Mok uh, came to lecture Mok in the study sessions at a later date already. Plus tard. And uh, he was uh, from the military. And I de la don't militaire. remember the other names uh, because I have noms. not taken note of Je these individuals. Can you remember Question. now what you studied during the study sessions? De ce que vous aviez étudié lors des séances d'études. Response. Réponse. During the study sessions, I remember first uh, we were educated we the cadres uh, were que nous, les cadres, lectured and that our detailed biographies uh, would be asked uh, to produce and we had to write down our class status, for example, work or peasant classes, and that we were encouraged in uh, the sessions to go to the people to convince them to join the resistance movement to liberate the country. Unfortunately, I have not had a copy of the Je uh, pas notes uh, that I would take during the study session. During the study Question. sessions, did you have to have, sorry, let me repeat. During the study sessions, did you ever have to study documents? Avez-vous eu à étudier des documents? Response. Réponse. No, I didn't. Mm. Uh, I I didn't have any documents left uh, with me. Je pas de document And moi. the reason I said no because je, after en fait, the non. war, no such document uh, was ever kept and uh, even my house and property Même was uh, maison, burned uh, during the war. The question, question was more la question que je vous on this line. Était comme si. When the teachers were teaching you, Quand on vous did they ever refer to documentation? Response. I'm afraid I cannot uh, respond to this question because um, these things happened a very long, long time ago. Cela fait très and long. my memory, again, is not uh, good enough to pas recollect uh, what uh, should be the detail of the study materials. I can't exactly object to materials being distributed in the study sessions, but I just would like to say that uh, we have experienced these wars and bombardments and all the suffering and uh, mais nous avons for vécu that des uh, I des souffrances. don't think my memory is Et good and I'm very sorry if uh, this statement is out of the topic and désolé that I'm not answering si to your question. I just attended the political study sessions lectured by Chujet, Elias and a few other and this is the account I still recollect et ce dont je me I am sorry if I cannot recall si Mr. President, I've Le asked open-ended questions about the details of the study sessions. The Ben Kiernan document does cover the detail. Can I please again now use this document as a memory-refreshing document? 
puis-je m'en servir comme un document pouvant rafraîchir la mémoire du thème. Response, you may proceed. Réponse. Rather, the uh, president, the you may proceed. Allez-y. No matter this document states, I quote. Question. Et dans le document, on voit. We studied documents on the situation in Kampuchea. Dit, vous, nous avons étudié des documents sur la situation en Kampuchea. Fighting the imperialists. Lutter contre les imperialistes. On the plan to evacuate the people from the enemy. Et when Mock taught us, close quote. Le plan d'évacuer les Does la population de l'ennemi that you were taught about the plan to evacuate the people a... from the enemy? Que pouvez-vous nous dire de ce sujet d'étude d'évacuer le peuple the president, uh, witness, hold down, counsel. The president. Kung Som On, you may now proceed. Le temps, Monsieur le témoin, la parole est à la défense. Counsel Kung Som On. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, may I ask uh, that co-prosecutor refer to the Puis EON number of the document he now citing from? Yes, forgive me, it's the same ERNs as the last entry. So Khmer 009-099936. French 00893546 and English 00419458. Mr. Numu, my question was, has this now refreshed your memory that you studied the plan to evacuate the people from the enemy? la population de l'ennemi. Response. Réponse. Tamok talked Tamok. about people the evacuation of the people from Phnom Penh. As for Chuchet, he said that people should not be evacuated. And at that time, Mok uh, was in charge of the military, and that Chuchet alias C was talking about not evacuating the people from Phnom Penh. Nonetheless, uh, his uh, objection uh, was uh, challenged uh, by Mok, uh, who would like all people in the cities be evacuated. This is what I learned uh, during the political session. Just so I'm clear, Question. did you personally hear Tamok talking about evacuating people Tamok from Phnom Penh de de at de Phnom Penh one of these meetings? Lors de ces réunions? Response. Réponse. Yes, I did. Oui. No, I Sometimes he asked me to Il attend military meetings and he would then talk about attacking Phnom Penh and that immediately after liberating Phnom Penh all the population in the cities had to be evacuated and he even pinpointed that uh, every war of life in the city, regardless of um, officials or civilians, uh, had to be uh, finally evacuated. And uh, he, at times, also warned the local 
cadres in particular those who challenged uh, such evacuation there were some people who did not agree with the idea that uh, the people should be evacuated from the city. They were of the opinion that such people or the city dwellers would not know much about farming and they would be um, allowed to uh, stay where they were. And these people, after all, after expressing such a opposing ideas uh, to the evacuation of the population from the cities would then be reprimanded uh, by the mock, uh, by, rather by mock on several occasions. Ces gens qui protestaient mock les réprimandés. That's all. Now, did Tamo talk about attacking Pompen and all the people being evacuated just on one occasion a-t-il parlé de or more than de one occasion in other Une words fois, did, did you hear this just once from Tamok or did you hear it more than once from Tamok plus d'une fois Response. Reports. During the meetings where cadres from the base attended, uh, les réunions, he would uh, talk les about this, and this is what Il I learned from him. I heard what he said. Uh, and these countries from the base would uh, be lectured on how or when the city was liberated and that the population had to be evacuated from Tamok uh, idea. Tamok Did Tamok say where the people were going to be evacuated to after Response. Tamok Response. would uh, evacuate uh, the population to different or every zone, including the southwest zone. La zone sud -ouest. And uh, people from Kandal province and also the et West Zone, de, all of them de de were de evacuated en masse. En masse. And uh, the people who, have, uh, who had been evacuated from Phnom Penh were placed uh, to live Phnom in the cooperatives. Some died, uh, some had to work hard to dig for some roots uh, to supplement uh, their food ration. I hope I answered your question. When Tamok was speaking about the plan in, in 1973, did he say whether this plan was just one involving the southwest zone? that you were in, un simple, un plan juste pour or la was it to involve other zones? Y avait -il zones? Response. He said, Réponse. the plan involved Le plan the whole country, regardless of entier. the southwest, the north, the east, le everyone le nord, had to be evacuated Tout from the city. When Tarmok Question. spoke of the plan, with all having plan. to be evacuated from Phnom Penh, Et que from every walk of life, que tout le monde devait être de Phnom Penh, les gens de toutes sortes, did he explain further what he meant by 
all dit, walks of ce life. Il dire par les gens de toutes sortes. Response. I'm afraid I can't answer this because uh, I was uh, at that time wounded and engaged in the battlefield to engage uh, to um, observe more closely what Tamok could have been saying or referring to because I had several medical reasons that I became very very ill and I had to be admitted to the hospital and discharged from, from duty. Did Tamok explain to you why the people needed to be evacuated? Response. Réponse. I don't know about this. Je sais. Because after I became very Car ill, I was no longer useful to malade, them and they did not use me anymore. Et donc, euh, ils ne se plus. At the meeting when Tamok was talking about the plan, and, and you were there. Que vous étiez là. Was Chuchet also present? Chuchet était-il présent lui aussi? Response. Réponse. I don't remember whether he was there. Je ne sais pas s'il était là ou non. I don't know. Je I can't say about this because, again, Je I end up répondre. being severely injured dit, in the battlefield and then the admitted to a hospital. Et and I had to buy some medicine from Phnom Penh because um, I was bleeding des, a lot and I became very initiated and I couldn't do anything. After the meeting when Tamok spoke of the plan to evacuate, Question. Après euh, la réunion où Tamok a évoqué le plan Did you go to any smaller meetings? Avez-vous participé when evacuation was discussed. Petite réunion où l'on a discuté de l'évacuation. I heard a rumor. J'ai entendu une rumeur. Other people, particularly from lower ranking cadres at the commune level. De cadres de rang inférieur au niveau de la commune. As I said, uh, because of my health status, Comme je dit, à cause de mes de santé, I needed uh, to be hospitalized, dû être and then I had to stay at home all the time, Ensuite, so they no longer needed me. I was no longer involved. Mr. Numo. Can I make it plain to you that Question. I'm not suggesting that you've done anything wrong? Je ne laisse pas entendre que vous, vous ayez fait that? quoi que ce soit de mal. Est-ce que vous me comprenez? Uh, I'll move on. Je passe à la suite. You said earlier that Chu Chet 
was against the evacuation. Vous avez dit que Chuchet était opposé à l'évacuation. How did you know this or find this out? Comment l'avez-vous su? He talked in the training session when he provided a political training session. He actually was the one who opened a training center for training cadres, and he also talked uh, about it uh, during a informal session uh, in the jungle. He made mention of it. What were you thinking Question. when you'd heard Tamok Après talking of a plan Tamok to evacuate all people from Phnom Penh? Et toute la population de Phnom Penh. And then you heard Chuchet saying he was against the evacuation. evacuation. How did you feel with those two different Quel était pieces votre of information? Confronté à ces deux informations différentes, que pensiez-vous? Réponse. One was uh, from the uh, political section, uh, the other was from the uh, military uh, section. Et l'autre de question From militaire. political section, they uh, induced people uh, to evacuate. Du côté and des it affaires was, um, politiques. Uh, and Il as uh, Tamok, uh, he was in charge of Tamuk, military affairs, il était chargé des affaires militaires. and he said uh, that people had to be evacuated uh, irregardless of the uh, zones, être uh, whether they were from southwest zone or any zone. zone but I did not know whether or not the plan was eventually evacuated, uh, but that's what I heard, si uh, that he was determined uh, that en tout cas, uh, evacuation je had to take place. I, I cannot say anything about uh, their decisions because je at that time, dire sur leur décision. Mr. Numa, you just the answer that came over interpretation was. Question. I didn't know about their decisions entendu, at that time. Vous avez dit, je it sounded pas like you were going to say some extra words. Were you vous alliez compléter. or not? Est-ce exact? Et ce, d'après ce que j'ai entendu en anglais. I'll move on. Je passe à la suite. Can you tell us if Tamok ever spoke about what was to happen to the Khmer Hanoi? Est-ce que Tamok a parlé du sort à réserver aux Khmer Hanoi? Réponse. There was a group of uh, Khmer resistant uh, forces known as Khmer de résistants Khmer Vietnam. Uh, they Vietnam. came to assist Cambodian uh, people. Ils sont venus aider les Cambodiens. There were approximately 2,000 or 3,000 
of them were ils étaient arrested. deux ou trois mille et ils ont été arrêtés. Those uh, Cambodian people had been to Vietnam before. C'était des Cambodgiens qui étaient There allés were au approximately Vietnam. Three thousand of them. Ils étaient environ trois mille. Later on, the resistance Par la suite, gained momentum. La résistance s'est développée. They sent those Khmer resistance forces carrying uh, a backpack as well as uh, some AK rifle ont été envoyés and shotgun. Un sac à dos they came to Cambodia and then 47. they were divided uh, into uh, various communes uh, in the country and they worked as experts. Pays. Those uh, who were trained in uh, army in Vietnam qui eu would be attached uh, to the uh, army. Those who were trained in Vietnam to be uh, cultural experts, they were attached uh, to cultural affairs. So there were de different culture, sections that they were divided. Ils and donc when they were mobilized to unités. fight against Lonel Soldier Quand ils ont été in the battles, se battre contre les soldats later de they gathered those people Ils ont été rassemblés. the Cambodian Hanoi people they actually gathered all of them uh, from Tous the commune uh, level as well as the uh, military de la commune. sections Ça également they gathered dans les those people Tous ces gens ont été rassemblés. then those people mysteriously disappeared Ensuite, Ils ont Nobody knew disparu. where they had been. Personne I could say that the number were around roughly over 2,000. Je they disappeared. I did not know where they were sent to. They never plus, returned. Ils ont disparu. Je ne sais pas où ils sont partis, mais ils ne sont jamais revenus. That's what I knew. Voilà and ce que je uh, by savais. my experience uh, back then. Voilà ce que j'ai su de par mon expérience. Le président. The president. Thank you, Mr. Prosecutor. Merci, and thank you, le Mr. Witness. Merci, le the time is now appropriate for adjournment. The chamber will adjourn now and pause. resume at 11. Court officer is instructed to assist oui, the witness uh, during the break and have him return to this courtroom by pour la 11. The court is adjourned. Suspension de l'audience. Some culture.